Hi everyone, this is Anuki Premachand Pals.lk and we are at the Demo Mercedes showroom here in Colombo for a very special event. They are sponsoring Team Shark, a group of students of the Mechanical Engineering Institute at the University of Muratua who are selected for the student racing uh, competition in the United Kingdom. So this group of students came up with the automobile all on their own and Demo is sponsoring them for the race. So we'll talk to them, we'll find out uh, more about today's event. Follow me inside. We're with Professor Kapila Pereira, the Dean of the Faculty of Engineering. So, sir, tell us what's special about today and why we're here. It's special because uh, in this country, uh, this is uh, every kid's dream, yeah. every parent's dream, mm -hmm. to put a car, uh, not just a car, it's a piece of uh, machine yeah. that competes, not in Sri Lanka, but going to compete in the uh, Silverstone yeah. track in July. So that is one of the things. Firstly, the secondly is more important than the nurturing the young inquiry minds. It's a corporate social responsibility, not only on the parents, not only of the university academics and the universities per se, but the industry and the networking between the industry and the academia and the students was made possible by media. Okay, so uh, now tell us what is uh, special about the piece of art I would say they've made over there. It's something that the students made on their own, is it? And they're taking part in an international racing circuit. How do you feel as the Dean of the Faculty of Engineering? These are your students, your products, how do you feel? More than me, the, stu the parents who produce these students and the teachers who have guided and brought them to this level are proud and I am also elated equally and my vice chancellor professor Ananda Jayawardena all the faculty all the students at University of Moratua are proud to uh, have produced this kind of intelligent people who can really produce things which will be really workable this is future Sri Lanka future seems to be going great so sir tell us how has um, the student faculty has changed over the years in the university. I'm sure you've been a part of it for quite a long time. So tell us about it. Uh, right now uh, our focus is not uh, just teaching. Yeah. It is making the students learn and then uh, build the, the students have the enormous potential because the University of Moroto Faculty of Engineering get the uh, best of the physical science stream. For example, 99% of the top 25% performers in Sri advanced level level uh, physical science in Sri Lanka is applying for Faculty of Engineering, University of Moratua. So, we are, it's our it's a challenge for us to uh, take on board these uh, top uh, notch students and bring them to the world class uh, international level. Yet relevant to Sri Lankan uh, context. So that is our thinking, our vision, our mission is to produce world-class graduates, yet they are relevant to the, the pulse of the Sri Lankan people on the streets. It was a pleasure talking to you. Thank you so Thank much. You. Thank you. We're with Mr. Vijitha Bandara, uh, a front-running figure in today's event. So, so tell us, who are you and what you do? Uh, I'm the Chief Operating Officer for the Tata Division. Um, basically, I handle the team after sales service, marketing and parts operation at DEMOS. So tell us, how did you stumble into uh, this and why, what made you sponsor the Faculty of Engineering uh, Moratua team and their quick? That's an interesting question because uh, one Sunday I was just reading the newspapers and I saw this article and this article had two 
relationships to me. One is because my son also is a team member in the Melbourne Uni uh, University of Monash in this Formula team. So I thought, why not uh, a Sri Lankan team to go to the same Silverstone track and race? So Murutu University has been the ideal university because we work with them. So I thought, okay, let's look at it and uh, t start talking to these guys. And uh, you know, from there onwards, yeah, we took it up and we, the board decided to fund it. And now we are going ahead and we'll be in Silverstone on July. Wow, so tell me, how has the past few months been? How, how have the kids taken it? How has the faculty as a whole taken it? Yeah, the boys are working. We have permanent, uh, uh, absorbed them as uh, trainee uh, engineers and they are working on the vehicle right throughout. So we have developed to the stage where we will be putting it on the track by uh, end of April. And um, there's a lot of support from the university as well. You could see the whole team is here. So it's a good, good, good it's feeling. Great, isn't it? All right. So what, um, what, how, how does DEMO, what is your relationship with the University of Moratua? What do you so if you take DEMOS, we are an automobile engineering company. We represent the world best brands with Mercedes, Tata and Siemens and all these brands. So and we recruit a lot of engineers from the Morotu University, especially mechanical. Uh, and more than the relationship with Morotu University, we want to do something for the society as well as as a small country. We want to take the brand of our talent to the international world. So and this Monotu University has opened up that opportunity and we are going to take that show. It's about making a mark on the map, yeah. isn't it? Are you going to, do you think Demo would continue this in the coming years with yeah, the we, University of Monotu? Yeah, we have looked at five years. Um, even if we don't be successful in this race, we want to win it one day. So we, we will work on it. We have got engineers from Mercedes-Benz coming down. And uh, you would see one gentleman over here, he's from Germany. He's also involved in the designing part of it. So we will make There's the team. There's a lot of international effort coming in as well. Of course, yes. So from our principals, uh, Mercedes and Tata, we are getting in a lot of technology also into the car. Wow, okay. Thank you so much. It was Thanks. a pleasure. Thank you so much. So we're with one of the front runners of the see right behind me. Tell me what. Tell me your name and what you do. Uh, my name is Harshan Kailasha and I am the team leader of this uh, Team Shark team. Team Shark. Okay, so he's the Team Shark team leader. How has it been the past few months working with Demo and coming up with the machine that's right behind us? Uh, actually, it was an impressive, uh, impressive experience for us yeah. working with Demo because they have the experience on automobile engineering and everything. Rather than going with another sponsor, this is really a good, uh, good opportunity for us uh, as well. Yeah. So what did you feel? Uh, I think Demo came to you and asked to sponsor you, isn't yeah. it? So how, what did you feel when that happened? Actually, before Debo came to us, we go to several sponsors. They rejected us. They said this is not this is an impossible thing to manufacture. Okay. So when Debo came to us, it like lighten our life <laughs> much more easier. Okay. For those of you who said they couldn't do it, the machine stands right behind us. It's a work of art, actually. How has it been coming up with it? Do you have a team of how many people? Uh, I got 19 team, team members okay. working here full time for this car the resources from Demo, how have they helped you? Uh, most, mostly financially they have helped us and uh, Demo training, automobile training school, they have given us the, all the technical support they needed and the, all the tools and equipments. Okay, so how has the university been? What have they told you? What is the resources they're providing you for them? Uh, actually from university, Mr. Sasuyanga Silla, he's always begging us and keeping us posted and giving up all the learning materials because in here we are learning mechanical engineering but other companies from Oxford University, they are engineering in automobile engineering. So uh, we are making that gap from uh, Mr. Sasan Silva, because he studied in advanced automobile engineering and everything, so we are learning from them and everything. He's teaching you what automobile uh, engineering is. How does it feel to go to the UK to the racing track in July? Yeah, it's a re again really good experience for us and really good competition because we got 
junior batch members who will take part in next year even as well. So good experience for them and because we haven't seen a single racing car like that before we go to the competition. Yeah. All other competitors have seen it for 20 years and likewise it's, it's there. Your first time, isn't it? There's a lot to expect. Uh, how has it been though? What, what about your competition? What do you know about the event that you all are taking part in? Uh, actually, we search on, normally like you, we search yeah. on online and <laughs> Google and everything. That's how we get to know his experience and everything. And we uh, we met Mr. Imran Shafiq. He's also Oxford Brook, from Oxford Brook University. He's participated participate that competition from there. So he uh, gave us all the tips and all the things, have, whatever we have to do and everything uh, in the competition. So you have your resource that way. All the very best. Thank and you very yes, we'll give the boys the support they need. Thank you. Thank you.